uh, five minutes, and <laughs> I want you to keep that energy, well, increase it, actually. <laughs> Please give it up for the incredible Zach Hunt, everybody! Keep it going for Joe Swanson. You guys, I'm about done with television. Like, not TV as an actual object, but like just shit that's on TV. Like, it's easy to say the media is irritating, but like, no show more than the fucking Today Show has gotten on my last nerves. And like, it's been a staple in my house since I was a kid, and I've been a drug addict for 20 years, so guess where I've lived most of my life? <laughs> oh. We have mom. <laughs> but it always starts off the same way, like, live from Rockabilly Center in New York's Today Show, blah, 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 shit. And like they come in, you expect like some news, like maybe back in the day, be like, oh, this just happened in Afghanistan, this happened here, and now it's like, uh, hot topic today, folks. Uh, studies have shown that you might be a chihuahua and not a cocker spaniel. <laughs> Stay tuned, we'll come back to you and let you know uh, what Dr. So and so from Kimball Mitchell University has to say on the matter. And then it'll come to a commercial, and then you get like real shit that should be on the news, like, did you and your family live in North Carolina from 1920 to 2020? You might have AIDS. <laughs> I'm like, my grandpa did, like, maybe that's why he really died. Anybody have a threesome? <laughs> Same, like, it's always like a 60% commitment though, right? It feels like a two-on-one handicap match. Like, not like you're fucking two handicapped people. Like, honestly, if anybody's a handicapped person in that situation, it's me. So, like, let's give applause to people who help with special needs. Because it was a special need. Thank you. And claps a weird thing too, like you want it at a show, but you don't want to get in the bedroom. Oh. Just like you don't want to get a battery charge, right? That right. everybody's looking for a battery charge. <laughs> and nobody, like in 1900, since we're going old school, Joe, like you would not want to be hung. Like to be hung in the street would draw fear in a man's heart, right? Now, 2020, men are dying to be hung. <laughs> True story. Since there's a couple ladies in here, y'all give me dick pics? I mean, I know it's a trend, I hear about it, and I'm not gonna ask for the evidence. This is just an open poll. But like, I don't stand that as a phenomenon. Like, when a guy sends me, he's like, and now I wait. Like, have, this, have any of you ever applied to a dick pic? Like, thank you, sir. No. Like, this was the gift I was looking for on my life. No. <laughs> I'm not sick. But like, it's also kind of weird because like, you want some element of surprise, right? Like, that's. And guys are always overselling, like, oh, I got a 10 inch dick. Why? Undersell, fellas. Girl asked me what I got, I'm like, I don't have a dick, bitch. Like, we gonna be slitting sisters tonight. Like, trying to do some arts and crafts, because I can sit the shit out of you. And you know, if you undersell, you have the element of shock and awe. Because when you show up, she's either gonna be shocked by the hog you got, or she'll be like, oh, at least you're honest. <laughs> And you know, I'm firmly against immigration, but not in the way that you're thinking. I'm all for every immigration that nobody else wants. Like, every immigration, like, it's exotic. No one from anywhere else sounds retarded like they do here. But I'm strongly against white people coming here from other Amen. countries. Right? Because I've never heard anything sound cool from, like, somebody from Australia. Like, hey, bitch, you trying to get late tonight? <laughs> You're not gonna fuck that dude. Or maybe some dude from Holland's like trying to hang out. Like, what's going on, my buddy? I know. But you give me some dude from the Congo, like my friend. We will go up to and we will have fun. <laughs> I'm down with that shit. <laughs> and I'll end on this. Do you guys know earlier in the year the pedophiles were trying to call themselves maps? Yeah, like not just door to the explorer kind of map, but like minor attracted people, people attracted to minors. If you didn't hear about it, that's how quickly America was like, yeah, we're gonna pass on that shit. But you know what? We should let them do that. Because now when we go to hunt them down, we're going on a fucking map quest. Alright, my name is Zach Thank you, that's my time.